We have listed the most important news on the world agenda for you. U.S. Secretary of State Antony Blinken's meeting with Russian Foreign Minister Sergei Lavrov in Delhi was only a brief encounter. U.S. State Department spokesman Ned Price said, Russian President Vladimir Putin's announcement that a Ukrainian sabotage group had crossed the Russian border and opened fire on civilians in a village has raised tensions in the region. U.S. National Security Council spokesman John Kirby said, The important thing is that Finland and Sweden join NATO. Whether that happens at the same time or not is not important. Yevgeny Prigozhin, commander of Russia's Wagner mercenary force, said his fighters had around the eastern Ukrainian town of Bamut, and Kiev troops had only one road left. South Korea and the U.S. will continue their joint exercises, Freedom Shield, and Warrior Shield from March 13 to 23. As diplomacy between the U.S. and Iran continues to deteriorate, the U.S. has imposed a new set of sanctions on Iran targeting the country's oil and petrochemical sales. To reach all the actual news fast and reliable worldwide, please don't forget to follow and like us.